Yo, yo, what's up guys? Uh, we are in Romania here and we are in one of the dormitory currently brand new. A <coughs> little bit they're still working on some things which I haven't yet been finished and I'm just doing here an Erasmus exchange program at Lucian Blaga University of Sibiu. And I wanted to share with you about the accommodation of 800 euros per month and everything that comes with the the package let's start with the most important thing which is the kitchen so a house cannot be a house without the kitchen so we are inside the kitchen here and this is the kitchen which is available in every floor so this building the three floor building and this is the second floor they're still working on it hasn't been completed yet so you can see this is the second floor and within here when you come into the kitchen this is the entrance door like here you can see here the written Bocatari. So let's start with here first. Normally it has like rooms in this second floor, that's why you see it is labeled like 200. That's the label. So three, th 30 floor, 300 something. So from beginning until the end here, so we have 23 rooms. 23 rooms. So for 23 rooms living in this apartment, your kitchen will be located at this side. So whenever you enter the kitchen like this one, you can see the kitchen is a two rooms. So here you have the storage location with fridges for everyone to stay. So in the fridge here inside, if you come in over here, you could fill all this up. So it could be sharing, maybe let's say room 223, 220, something you share this fridge. Like some takes some of the sides on top and others could keep it. But this is just a freezer, it's not a freezer. It's not freezer, it's just a fridge. Normal, regular fridge, no freezer. So and here the dining area for the people just to come and chill over here. The dining, let me turn the light on. This is the dining location. So coming where the main kitchen where it is. So this is the kitchen. So over here you have the electrical stove and you're turning it on that you just place like here and it's ready to go. And you could increase or decrease over here. Now we are dealing with this one and this one, this one, this one this stove this stove is here let me off it and also it is a brand new like electric brand of artisanals i'm not here to promote the brand but also you have the light here you have also the fan so you can cook here and it is noise free also we have cupboards on top like here like here you can see you could put your materials over here also these are divided like you could find maybe this from a certain room you're using this couple to store your stuff but some of them could use this one you just divide it is over here so this will be a kitchen for you prefer whether your stuff are here to use or you can come and just use even if your stuff are there you come and cook over here which one is open and here we have got the oven so you can see the oven here you can set it up with the plates and everything kind of looking cool and here down also still have cupboards where you could store your materials and stuff like that here to be used for regular and the washing basin and here you could have normal using utensils as you see here on top too so this is first kitchen the second kitchen here which is also complete and the third kitchen so you can share and those are cupboards depending to the division and also here we have a small dining locality but also over here we have another thing which is a microwave so to heat and warm something in a quick way you can just come here and select and you're ready to go and here also we have the toast machine which you could just take the pill put it over there and you could lighten it you know the student usage is not that much now clean you know students now and here we have the coffee machine but also could get yourself tea hot water over here you just come and you press the it is already connected here so you can just go and play with it set your time here medium heat whatsoever and you can make a regular coffee or tea from this one so after we are done with that one this is how the outside looks like ulbc university lucian blaga din sibiu you can see a lot of professors here informative the contact and other things that's not the topic let's just get into the things so Coming, this is still the second floor. We just came from the kitchen. Now we're going up there to the third floor. These are lifts, but also here, if for those people who want to smoke, because you can't smoke inside here, will be more irritating. So let's check here out. 
So when you come over here, this is the sitting chilling area. So you just come here like you, now they they're still working on it. So they brought a new chair, but more, back in the days, like students used to carry chair, those sitting chairs from the kitchen and bring over here, sit over here. You can see a cigarettes remaining. So people come over here and smoke, and also you could have a good weather, like breathing from this side. So you can see you'll have a nice view from the morning or any time you just come over here. All this will be yours. And you can see from here, uh, which I'll take you downstairs over there, we have the sitting location over there, and also we have the playground right over there. It's a very huge study. We're gonna go over there, but first of all, let's go through these stairs here on top. I need to show you a little bit about the rooms, but actually I could have shown you from here, but I wanna show you also the washing machine and everything you have access with so you can see the corridors how they look alike i'm trying to do it in a wide angle this is the third floor but the end side of the third floor you can see we have spalatorie which will be the washing machine coming over here now you can see we got our washing machine because it's still new new like housing still don't have much stuff and you can see just have but you also second washing machine is third fourth fifth and you can see here from outside you have the heater here so to kind of warm and dry your coat also in a quick way and you have this view over here this is all yours see that guys yeah and over there also like you can come and breathe here waste your time also and also you see these also could also be washing machines in case it has to be occupied like from down i think all floors they have to come and wash from this side coming back to this side here to here see this side also you have this view which you'll be enjoying but from here also i think this should be the door you can go through the stairs from this side you don't have all of you to come and go through the middle door and also i think after the time they'll have elevators for people you know to kind of lift things up in case you are coming with your luggage you don't have to walk and then between here you can see us still have access to heaters like so to kind of warm over in the location now let's go show you some rooms i think let's try see if rooms are open closed let's see if it's open this is how the room it looks like like a wide angle you can see from here now we're entering as you enter so you have one bed over here and the other bed over here which will be sharing you have the ac over there which can be turned also to do like heating stuff and you have cupboard like for this side you have the upper side here you can fill this all up just for single students here and down here you have all these rooms one two three four five this and this here you can put your bag over here hang on your towels coming to this side there's the same that's the same like that coming to this side here you could see here is a working the office space so over here you got all these over here dividing here this will be one side for a student maybe this one and this one for the other student who will be from that side and also you can stock some of your materials here books also ever if you like to read so much yeah but also here the other things on the here also down you got you can store some things also here and you got the drawers you can do the charging system for someone who will be sleeping here you got it over here and for someone sleeping over here you have it from this side here this side close to here so you can just squeeze it and touch over there once you're on your bed there you can still charge and also once you're working over here the charging system is down over here but also the internet port is here and once you come here you have this electric heat also to warm up the entire room and also you have like nice looking could see these curtains over here and the outside view and the windows how they open actually before you go to the restrooms so now like here this is totally locked if you bring it here down now you can open it to wide open like that wow nice here yeah. and you'll be able to see the entire view from the top over here but if you if it is like this if you push it until on top 
we can open it from the top so can say thank you is more than kind of things and this is our restroom now which on and see inside how it looks like this is the restroom so yeah i'm here guys we are working on it yeah so the on the restrooms you have the dressing table over here whereby you can see now if you turn you have also here the you could plug in the materials for those sh shaving your hairs or whatsoever and also once you turn on the light you got the right over here so you can come here and dress and look yourself how you look yeah keep yourself a little bit well yeah like that you do this but also you have the other light which is a general light you just turn it from here and also here you have the curtain to kind of separate the location and here you have the bazin you know the showering bazin also but you have some some yeah, as and everything you can keep everything you can see like it's a typical beautiful you know washing rooms or restroom restrooms right guys yeah, sorry and here you have also the heater so to kind of warm here so towels you dry as so well those underwears you can dry them from the restrooms and the rest is just you can see and also here they kind of keep soaps here so you just flush and your soap you can see it comes from this side i think this is yeah you can see that blue flesh yeah you can see so it's a little bit burning and the window is the same style lighting and everything I think it's perfect like for eighty dollars eighty dollars and the bazine and everything tell me guys in the comment section how does it look like how does it look so i think we are done here we should off everything yeah so now we coming out guys so we just came on to this the ground floor over here now you can see also they have work spaces i don't know if the lighting will work yeah so this is the ground floor like the from the entrance i think it should be like a waiting room somewhere sitting because they're still working on it they I, I spoke with the watchman and he told me like they're still working on it ain't finished yet so i'm just trying to still here to look cool and you can see also here they're still bringing some other stuffs over here you can see still so they're still working on it guys yeah so when you come from the ground floor like from the other dormitory which is that side which is number i think number how many i don't know and the administration will be here so they have like a wait place here where people could come and chill or the office also for the entrance and when you come over here they got some cameras to kind of control everything going on within the room yeah, we saw cameras everywhere like that one and whenever you go through everywhere we have cameras so i'm trying to guess so this is our door here for 80 euros which is like 400 lei now when you are speaking and that from the entrance here now they have the system where if you come you need to exit you push the button and you open like that and when you come in you need to use the card to scan over there so to kind of keep a control of who can have access inside and who can not you get it so let's come here now outside this is how it looks like from outside i think the coloring ain't that bad yeah some yellowish kind of normal like not that what but you can see also outside how it looks like they're still working i think on the everything here because it's new i think they're still working on it so when you come to this side for the studio now let me show you here it is nice you know nice sunlight yeah so coming to this side mostly you can see this study is most used by a lot of people can be booked by now a lot so people to kind of exercise close from here you can see all those are like goal sets over here you can divide half 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 like four different teams could play for just exercising, but when it's a big match, could just be played from this side to this side, which will be a hundred meters. Also, let's come a little bit here. You can see also the kind of breeze which is available over here, like kind of natural, like only birds 
I don't know what type of bed those one there. Yeah, so coming here also, I think they'll put some things down over here. I don't know. Yeah, but not, yeah, see, that's uh, natural. Wow. And here you have like the chill area where you can come here and sit and enjoy like a nice conversation. Like that, you come, you discuss a little bit, you talk about something. Also, smoking people come also to smoke over here. You can see these like dustbin kind or trashy stuff. We also used to throw some cigarettes inside there. So smoking also is done from this side. And also during rain or sun, also people could chill from this location. Yep. And also we have one thing here which I should should be I think like the last. You can see also how it looks like it's kind of cool. The distance to walk from here to the university is kind of like 20, 28 or 29 minutes. But if you take a bus or bolt, it's just like seven or four minutes here to the hospital. So from the other dormitory, you can see like they have this, I don't know how do you call them. Let me just try them and hope you see guys. So you come over here and sit. So you just sit like this. I don't know how we call it. We call it the Mbe in Swahili language, but in English, I don't know. It's actually what? So also you can come over and chill, go on with your work if it's minding homework or relaxing. Especially during the morning, I think it's way more better when the weather is kind of cool. You could just sit over here, like especially the sun rises from this side, so you are direct facing right. But also it's movable, I think they can move it to anywhere. But this dorm over here, because it's more occupied, that's why I think they kind of close here. But I think. Within the days, maybe when the other dormitory will be completed, it will be more occupied. Also, I think one will be the other side, or they'll try to balance. I don't know. Yeah, so this is also in which you can enjoy. And also, we have, I think, bike parking somewhere, just like here. I could see from the other side, and that's it. So, I think. You have enjoyed like a little tour for the locality and you have the idea about the life. But a quick note, all dormitories aren't the same. Like some dormitories are too old. For example, here they have a total of seven dormitories. So the other dormitories, like number three, I don't know number how many, they are too old. Too old. Like even if you see the picture for the kitchen, it's a mess. So, uh, these are the greens. I don't know how much they pay over there, but they will pay 8 euros, so that I'm not concerned about it. So I can say, we can finalize by saying thank you so much for watching. And we're gonna see you somewhere. Welcome to Sli, welcome to Romania. And for those who want to come and study in Romania, or you wanna go and study in Italy, and you're looking maybe for consultant or getting, let me stop up the light. Looking for consultant or looking for, looking for consultant or you're looking for an agent like to help you with getting admission, you can just hit us or click the link on the description box below and use the promo code or you can hit me direct on Instagram. We can work on you and see the budget because Italy's education is free. People who can help you in getting admission that to Italy and once you go there you start for free. So you just pay us like the service fee to get your admission to Italian universities. Yeah, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'll see you. Bye.